Hello crowd, welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man X for 16-bit somewhere, and we're going to be fighting Douchebag Octopus. Launch Octopus. He's the worst ever. <laughs> I really dislike him. Um, he just—he has two sub-bosses. And they're not, like, impossible to fight. They just... They're so annoying to fight. Uh, and he has all those super little boats. You'll see. If you have, if you don't, I don't know why I'm talking about it. Like, like if I'm, I'm, I'm just assuming that everyone's played this amazing game because <laughs> it's amazing. But I'm just talking as if though everyone knows, and I really shouldn't be. I should just be like, oh, watch this. You're gonna be all like, whoa, this guy's a prick. Really? All right. This, this is one of them. It's not so hard, it's just, just kind of frustrating, I guess, I should say. He blows you away. This one's not, like, bad. See, he's, like, already dying. He's just like, ah, oh, well, I would like that health. Shame I can't get over there. There we go. He was like, alright, welcome over here, here we go. Alright. Uh, these fish are annoying. This, like, this, I, I just have, like, a childhood hate. For this level, because this this guy's the worst. He just because uh, he like goes to suck you in. Yep, you're dead. Yep, oh, God, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh no, no! Oh. The anger I feel in the pits of my stomach. All right, maybe I don't know. I don't do anything. <laughs> uh, maybe like something will be good against them. I never really tried a lot of things. Oh. Right off the map, done. I think I'm dead. I think I'm alive. Yep. Pretty much just like, you gotta just kill this, like, kill this guy quick. You just gotta be ready for this shit. And I'm never, I never am. Because when you get too high up, it stops sucking you in. So then it just messes with it because you're going too far to compensate for the wind. And then you're gonna fall into the other spike pit. It's almost like it was designed that way. Thank God. If that guy hit me in those spikes, I probably would have just quit. Alright. Alright, this is one of those, um... There it goes. Okay, never mind, never mind. So you can go up. Just, that's just, like, a cool way to show you that you, like, can go up if you want. Uh, not for long. That crap. There's some, I think there's like a boat up here and it has like a heart piece in it. No, it like, that's how like you get to the uh, heart piece or something like that. Something along those lines. Alright, this guy. Yeah, I can see the boat up here is like raining down bombs on your face. Ah, you piece of shit. Whatever. I'll get it. Eventually. Hates level. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright. So you can just bomb the shit out of them. No! Stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. There it goes. So now you ride this bad boy down. And see, he smashes the ground below him. And you slip right in here. And I'm running out of shit to use. This is where you fight another sub boss. Yep, that was hard. <laughs> I never used the tornado on him when I was younger, and it takes forever if you don't. So, fun fact: <laughs> use just use the damn tornado. <laughs> Ooh, almost. All right, all right. Storm. Oh crap! He may be weak to Storm Eagle's attack. Cause I don't know who's weak to Storm Eagle's attack now. Well, no, it was the mammoth, wasn't it? Wasn't it? Yeah, it was. Yeah, yeah, it was the mammoth. Never mind. Um, uh, whose attack did I use against him? Rolling shield. Maybe he's with the rolling shield. I got one of these, so I gotta make it count. There it is. Ah, oh, what? Wow, it still did a lot of damage. There it goes. So, yeah, when I was younger, I would never use, like, the powers. I don't know why. But, so I did, like, the whole game with the X-Buster constantly. 
That's what took me so long. Get the fuck. There you go. <laughs> All right, so I'm pretty sure he's weak to this. I could be wrong. He could be weak to rolling shield. But we'll find out. I know no matter what, that chameleon's weak against him. I'm on it. Because you cut off his arms with this. It's pretty awesome. So, like, just land one hit and his... Wait, what? Not one hit? There it goes. Okay, three hits. But he's not weak to it. I was, I was wrong about that. So, it probably is not shield. Yeah, it's not shield. God, he's still so annoying because his missiles... Like, still... Like, you don't... It doesn't stun him or anything. I'm using... I'm using... I'm just gonna use sub tank. How do I care? <laughs> How do I do it? Am I in the right button? And if he, like, if you don't take away his arms, he, um, he does other shit. Like, he does, like, a whirl, like, a whirlpool attack, and it's really annoying. <laughs> That's where, like, again, the powers kind of, like, totally murder the bad guys. Alright. So I need the last sub-tank. I think I have all the hearts. Except for chameleons, obviously. So this one's good. It's a homing missile. So in general, just good to have against bad guys who like fly around a lot. I got his heart. I got his heart. 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 Did I get heart here? Yeah, I did. Okay, so I have all the hearts except for in here. And we'll do this here. Make this in a long episode. We have to plans for a total of hour and an hour and twenty minutes right now. So. So much for my hour or so statement earlier. I granted I did say without getting upgrades. Alright. For some reason, when I was younger, I used to hide behind this tree in our planes level. And I would just shoot. I don't know why, but it entertained me for like a half an hour every time I started this level. So whenever um I would start this level, my brother would hate it, because I would just have to like sit there for like twenty minutes. And just laugh at what was going on. <laughs> and just for some reason, like it coming out of the tree, like no one's there, like, huh, uh, uh, humor. Okay. So now there's two. There's two secret paths here. Actually, the heart is down, and that, that, I think it's the upgrade is up. So what you do? This is pretty annoying to get. I never. It's still like. It's always been hard for me to do. Ah crap. So you want to get rid of all these rocks. I think it's easiest if you use this. I think. There you go. But then getting back is like, you know, fucking ass too. All right, there you go. Okay. And then, at the same point, you go up and fight the most annoying sub boss ever. I don't think he's, he he doesn't have a health bar, so I don't know if anything's weak to him. I think Rolling Shield is. I've been told that. I I never got a confirmation. I never looked it up on the internet or anything. Just Rolling Shield's pretty much like the best in the game because it's it's what Sigma's weak against, like the final boss. So yeah, so all right, that Armored Armadillo guy is like the fucking man. Ah, no, don't hurt me. Uh, he, um, Armor Armadillo can take down Launch Octopus, which in my opinion is, like, the, one of the worst guys ever. And <laughs> he can, uh, take down Sigma if you really want it. What we... God. I don't think this is weak against him. I think I'm just wasting my shit at this point. But it's very easy, because you can just come in from the sky. Fire, maybe? Oh, no! It's not fire! <laughs> Tornado does nothing. Not at all. Yeah, wow, so it really does nothing at all. Okay. Keep trying. Maybe this guy. That sounded like a disadvantage. Maybe, uh... It's kind of easier, because I can just shoot the wall. I'm just this. Ah, crap. Got him in the face. This is the most intense boss battle ever. 
It's really just frustrating. It's like, because it takes forever. That's the whole point, because it gives you the chest upgrade. How could I forget that? Also, his stomach, it's a stupid looking face. I don't know why the explosion looks like, so I think that. Boom. I did it. I beat the game. <laughs> This capsule contains a new type of body armor. A new type of axe body spray. It will reduce damage to your systems and ego by 50%. Because ladies will love you 50% more, Mega Man. Now spray it. Spray it all over your clothes. Bing. So now you can just take more damage. Why can't I leave this? Wait, what do you want from me? Okay. <laughs> Alright, so now we gotta go to the rest of the level. I got everything. Probably should have came here a lot sooner to fight that guy. It would have been easier. Just being able to take all the hits. You can see, like, I'm taking, like, little or no damage. I'm just skipping through this. There's not really anything relevant here. Just a few baddies. And then you get over here. There's a hummingbird. Throw shit at you. It's pretty annoying. Or a woodpecker, I guess. Not a hummingbird. He's not hum. He hums, he hums tunes of death and destruction. Alright. So there you go. And then you get here. This is pretty much the end of the level. So walk over here and you punch some crap and you punch some crap and then you take life and then you punch some crap and then you take some life and you punch some. Get out of the quicksand and you punch some crap and you take some life and you punch some guy and falls in the sand and he's like, oh no, my robot dead. And I'm like, you're a robot too, so it doesn't matter. Let's go to the zoo. It's like, I don't want to go to the zoo. Go. The only thing I hated about uh, these robots is how you couldn't... And they fix it in the other Mega Man axes. You couldn't take them into boss rooms, which is kind of... It's like, it was a dream of mine when I played this originally. Because you get here, and it's the boss door, right? Like, after all this. If you go through all this crap, to, keep, to make sure your like robot stays alive. And you're like, ah, I can't get in. It just kind of hurts, man. Cause you just you want them there so bad. You want you want them, cause you love them. And he wants to be there for you. This chameleon's like pretty difficult to fight without the X Buster too. It's not impossible though. Pretty sure he's weak to this. Pretty sure. Uh, maybe not. It doesn't seem like he is. Was oh was he weak to Rolling Shield? No, because the octopus was. Right? Is he, he's not with fire. Tornado? No, that was the mammoth. Is he weak, oh, is he weak to this? No. Boomerang. It's gotta be boomerang. Yep, boomerang. Oh, that's right, because you can get him stuck in a loop. This is the loop, by the way. <laughs> The explosion noise, it came back. Woo, explosion noise, woo! There you go, they get Chameleon's power, which is like, maybe the most useless. It's good because it, when you charge it, it makes you invincible for a short time, and it helps you get through a lot of Sigma parts. It's about on that, it's like, eh. Alright, so there you go. Got everything. Beat all the bosses. Finally, we have found Sigma's fortress. I don't think this was his voice, but I'm sticking with it now. Let's go in and put a put. How's it out? And out <laughs> and put an end to his war against the humans. So then you gotta go to Sigma's level, which is now here. Um, you can go back to these levels and get all the crap if you want. Um, let's see. I'll just I'll try this. Real quick. Should I? Do I get a pass code for this? The pass goes to go directly here. I have to leave soon. Oh, well, I should have stopped the recording. I'll do that. Let's see if we can't get through this real quick. Let's split up. Hold my hand. I'll go in first, and then you can slip in while I keep the main defense force busy. Alright. When we get back, we're going to be uh, tackling Sigma's first level. Till then, thanks for watching. Please remember to always, Stone Stay.